it's beginning to look a lot like Simsmith. Hey guys, welcome to my channel and welcome back to Simsmith. It's day four of Simsmith. And here I am with another makeover, Christmas makeover thing. But this time we're giving my Sims makeover. Last time we gave the houses of all of my Let's Plays and apartments um, a makeover. But today we're doing all of my Sims. So we're starting with Scarlet Regenboog from the Rainbow Legacy Challenge. Regenboog is a Dutch word for rainbow, if you don't know. And since this is the Rainbow Legacy, there is a certain color that I sort of have to keep in mind. And that is red, because she is from Generation Red, the first generation. Uh, depends on which way you go, I guess. You can start with any color if you want to. But I started with the color red. So that's the color that I kept in mind. So I gave her this sweater with um, red around her, like... Um, I don't know, what's that called? Like her arms, the end of her arms where her hands are <laughs> and her shoulder area. And I guess for all of these Sims, I gave them a wintry Christmas, sometimes Christmas, not always, but at least a winter outfit just to keep them warm in their everyday wear. Um, so some of them got a uh, Christmas sweater or just um, a jacket to keep them warm. Or I don't know, some of them were wearing shorts or like short dresses. So I gave them some jeans or You'll see what I mean. And then I also gave all of my sims, I'm pretty sure all of my sims, a new um, formal wear outfit that's a little more formal than they had before because I have a tendency to give my sims a very casual formal outfit, if that makes sense. Probably not. Uh, and then I sort of go through all of their outfits and picking out some more wintry stuff. Like, for example, right now I'm giving her a sweater for her sleepwear just to keep her warm because she does sleep in a field right now because she doesn't have any money if you do follow my rainbow legacy challenge you probably know what i'm talking about and as you can see this is also way too summery for her party wear and you know christmas is a time like december is a time for parties and dinners so you need formal wear and party wear that's like a really important part of it obviously not everyone does something like that so casual wear also important but for her party wear, I gave her this really, really nice dress that sort of looks like it's red and sparkly. And that's just Christmas in one dress. That's just the perfect dress for Christmas. So I'm really glad I gave her that. Some tights to keep her warm. But we're already moved on to the second household. This is Penelope Staples. And Penelope is really obsessed with fashion. She really, really, really loves fashion. And also the color pink. And I gave her a pretty casual outfit for her. She doesn't really go go casual usually. But I gave her this really, really cute pink sweater to keep her warm. Then some really high socks. Some tie high socks, if that's how you pronounce that. Um, with some lace to keep it nice and sophisticated. Because obviously she does like more sophisticated stuff. Or I guess fashionable stuff than just a casual sweater so this is really casual for her she doesn't really wear something like this but every single one of my sims needs an outfit to just chill and not do anything and just hang out in front of the fireplace or next to the tree or whatever she doesn't really have anything because she's poor because she wasted all her money on ex expensive clothing if you follow my city living let's play you'll know that story but for the people who don't that's is why she doesn't have any stuff in her apartment but i did give her a nice christmas tree because every single person deserves a christmas tree even if they don't have money so yeah this is what i went for obviously we need some accessories uh, because it wouldn't be Penelope Staples if she didn't go all out <laughs> so giving her nothing doesn't seem like the right choice and I was experimenting with this choker and I really like it and I really like how she looks in it. But I just didn't think it would fit her personality. So I ended up not giving her that, but I gave her a scarf. Obviously, it, I really liked it because it matches the color of her skirt and also it's really wintry and nice. I gave her a wi wing ring. Would be cool if I gave her wings, but I didn't. Now we're moved on to her formal wear. I love her formal wear. Her dress, that dress just looks amazing on her. But I also liked some other dresses. So I'm pretty sure I gave her another dress. This one looked really nice on her. I love that city living dress. I have a recolor of it. So I pretty much have it in every single color. I love that dress. It looks so nice. It looks so 
classy and sophisticated and I just loved it and it looked really good on her body. <laughs> and our party wear, obviously we're going all out, so I gave her a really nice sparkly pinkish purpley dress. Looks amazing on her. I wouldn't be able to pull it off, but it really looks good on her. And I feel like she would be the center of the attention on every single party that she goes to. Which is exactly what she likes. So, <laughs> it's a good dress for her. And now we're moving on to our band. Which now has a name, yes. <laughs> Finally. Um, they were all... Especially Savannah, she didn't have any clothing all, uh, on at all, basically. So I gave her a winter outfit that still sort of stays th true to who she is. It doesn't show too much skin. Um, I mean, it, it doesn't cover too much skin, but it's still warm. Like, you can see a little bit of her belly and it's like, you know, because she likes to show off her body and her... Oh my god! I hit my dart. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I hope it didn't scare you. I scared myself there. Um, so yeah, uh, you saw, just saw the casual outfit. I didn't because I looked away for a second. That's how fast this is going. And obviously, a formal wear that does the same. <laughs> Very nice, sparkly, but does show off her body. And now we're going for a Christmas sweater for her sleeper. I'm not sure if I stick with this or if I change it back to something else. Um, I think I just stick with her normal outfits. Yeah, I don't think I add anything. Also, if you see the crazy outfits and you haven't seen my creative sim, you probably don't know why. Actually, have I done a creative sim on the, this? On, I, I'm pretty sure I didn't. No. So that's the first time you're seeing their bent outfit. Yeah, they're obsessed with aliens. So I gave them like a really weird alien-like suit. And every single person has that works into their outfit one way or another. Um, so that was her version of it, but it's obviously not something you want to wear to just a normal party uh, In my mind they would be performing at a par party So that's the outfit that they wear because they like to match and just have you know their Alien theme show through their space alien theme But we want something else uh, This is Marvin. Marvin likes to wear uh, feminine clothing as well as uh, masculine clothing so he has lots of options, uh, but that does make it hard because it's just a little too much option and not all of the clothing for, f I mean, originally made for female sims look good on male sims. So it's just something to figure out, I guess. I wanted to give him a jacket, but that uh, isn't enabled for f male sims. Um, so yeah, I don't know. Marvin just really likes to go all out and just do something crazy, but I gave him a Christmas sweater in the end as you can see Oh, I didn't I thought I did but I guess I didn't um, I Was working on his oh, I t I changed it. Okay. Uh, I was working on his formal wear But I guess I oh, this is what I gave him. Yeah, that looks nice But I just loved that formal wear for him. I don't know I just loved how crazy it looked and I thought it would be perfect for a Christmas party anyway White like the snow. Uh, I actually changed it to have a white to gray purplish color gradient because I liked it more. Um, and as you can see, that's his version of the band outfit. Uh, he has really, really big boots to sort of look like like shoes should wear on the moon. <laughs> I don't know if that's what I was going for. And then I gave him this outfit because I think it looks really good on him. I love the black and white on it and I just think it looks really good. Um, apparently I did something to Savannah again. Um, Alexander! He's the most, most normal looking sim, if there's a definition for normal, which there isn't. But we're just going to say that he's the more most everyday looking or something like that. You wouldn't really pick him out in a crowd as much as the rest of them. Um, I didn't really change much for his party wear because I liked the top jacket thing he had on. Because, But I removed the crazy space suit. Thing for the band performance and the last person in this household is Harley Goodrich um, and I also stuck with her origin original outfit pretty well I just changed the color of her skirt and I also gave her a Christmas sweater I really love how just casual how nice she looks in such a casual simple outfit she doesn't need much I love the flowiness of her outfit too um, <laughs> apparently I did something else again uh, with Savannah's outfit. <laughs> I love her version of um, 
the band outfit she just goes all out she's like if we're gonna wear this suit if we're gonna wear this crazy suit i'm doing it i'm not going to cover it up with anything this is just how i'm going to look and she looks amazing in it she does have a nice body to wear that suit um <laughs> and we're on to the last city living let's play family if you know there is another one but we haven't really played with that one at all yet it he will come into the let's play at a later point but it just needs to advance a little more in their story but i'm not going to give him a, a makeover my god because it isn't really needed <laughs> so now we are working on kylie and i think kylie is my favorite sim at least in looks i just love how cute she looks she's just oh, she's so cute i i don't know i just like it i'm really curious to know what she would look like if she ages up to a teen but she also really likes crazy outfits so i gave her this snowman outfit and also um a nice everyday outfit with the really nice top with the open back it looks really good on her i haven't found any sim that that looks good on but it looks good on her so that's really nice <laughs> i was worried that it wouldn't look good on any sim but it does now we have brayden and to be honest i was looking something that looks a little more dorky it isn't he looked really really cool in that outfit i don't think it's cool to use the word cool but if you know what i mean he just looked a little too fancy it's like he's not really grown into he isn't really confident yet and he looked he looked really confident i think that's the word i was looking for and lastly the disney Le disney legacy challenge family oh my god i'm so excited that i can't even speak i actually already gave them a winter makeover but it's you can always add more to it <laughs> so i gave her a really really nice champagne looking outfit because it reminded me of new year's eve so that's something i can give her to wear for new year's eve maybe possibly something else but i won't tell you what that is yet that's a surprise <laughs> you might be able to guess it now but i'm going to keep quiet for a little little longer but you'll figure it out at the end of simsmas <laughs> And also Jack, I gave him a really, really funny looking Christmas sweater and a little more fancy outfit for Christmas because I just like the way that looked. And lastly, we're working on Snow White, Sam Beanstalk in the game. Uh, but she's really pregnant, like, boo, the baby, baby bump is showing. So out giving her outfit wasn't the easiest task ever. Because I needed to look good with her baby bump. But I think I succeeded in the end. I changed one of her dresses to this really nice sweater dress. I think that would be really comfortable in this stage of her pregnancy. Some tights. Don't think if that... I don't know if that would be comfortable. But I don't know. Uh, party wear also it doesn't really look good. So I was looking for a dress that made her baby bump look good. Although when it comes to Christmas she might already have, a, have had a baby. So... I don't know if it's needed, but this dress would also look good. All of the outfits will also look good if she doesn't, if she isn't pregnant anymore. But this video is over, so thank you so much for watching, and I will see you very soon. Goodbye.